Toro Rosso's Daniil Kvyat is a changed man. The Russian returning to F1 in a far stronger mental space after a year on the sidelines with Ferrari. Kvyat has shown the way to his rookie teammate Alex Albon with 6-3 in qualifying after nine races, making it to Q3 three times to Albon's one and 4-2 in races when they could be compared. France, though, was damage limitation for Kvyat after taking on Honda's Spec 3 engine, the penalties forcing him to start from the back of the grid. 14th after a late race dice with Albon, a good result after a long first stint on Pirelli's hard tires. Austria wasn't much better. The Russian compromised in qualifying and finished 17th. But Kvyat knows he's got a competitive top 10 car, one that he looked forward to driving from its initial shakedown. I'm really looking forward to drive for, with the Honda powered engine. And uh, so far, I see a lot of uh, hard working, dedicated people and engineers there. And it's very promising for the future. And uh, hopefully, there will be a lot of uh, good things coming from their side. The 25-year-old is also very comfortable with the squad. Kvyat's return to Red Bull's B-team his third time since 2014. My first ever test uh, was with Toro Rosso. My first ever race in Formula 1 with Toro Rosso as well. And uh, a bunch of very talented people. And uh, we'll be working on ext extracting everything out of uh, our talent uh, this year. For now, Kvyat's chances at another season with Toro Rosso are looking good. 2019, a shot at rebuilding what was a broken career. After falling out of favor with Red Bull, dropped from the brand's top team in early 2016 after being unable to deliver against Daniel Ricciardo. But a strong season with consistent points is all he needs to keep his F1 dream alive. And with a happy outlook, he's on track to do that. Thanks for watching. To stay up to speed on all things Formula One, make sure you hit the subscribe button.